Good afternoon. I'm Jeff from JT's Comics and Cards, and hope everybody's doing good. And this video is like, I've been getting a lot of comments asking to see a lot more of the Black Panther comic books that I have, and roughly how much they're worth. And I'm going to do that right now for you. But first of all, I finally got the address at the comic book convention we're going to be setting up at. It's going to be March 25th at the Holiday Inn in Norwich. I believe it's right off of 395. So this is going to be the comic book show we're going to be setting up at. Hopefully everybody can um, can join uh, can go to it. It's on a Saturday. It's March 25th at the Holiday Inn and it's right off of 395. That being said, so I went in my collection and found the Black Panther comic books I have and they're mostly done by Jack Kirby. So this is going to be the 30 cents each on the cover. This is a number one, and it's 1977, the same year Star Wars came out. This is Black Panther number one. That one, in near mint condition, graded, is $350. That's what it sold for, and that's, that's quite a bit of money. That's Black Panther number one, 1977. I can show you what the insides look like because, uh, you know, off white pages to white pages. Again, that's Black Panther number one. Now I have Black Panther number two. Uh, this is the 1976, it says. Wow. No, 1977. And it's drawn by Jack Kirby. This is Black Panther number two. And the cover is 30 cents. This one sold for $300. Drawn by Jack Kirby. White pages. I keep these all in bags and backing boards. Again, this is Black Panther number two. I got a couple of those. Now this is Black Panther number three. Chaos in King Solomon's tomb. Lurking evil stalks the haunted halls. Again, this is 1977. And it's drawn by Jack Kirby. Number three. And this one sold for ninety-five dollars. I like the way he drew comic books, like square. Nobody else could draw like him. Now Black Panther number four. Raw Power versus the Occult. See the Jungle Avenger in battle with the Collectors. This is Black Panther number four. That one sold for $100. Again, it's drawn by Jack Kirby. 1977, July. I bought these when they came out, right up the newsstand. I used to buy a thousand comic books at a time. This is a Black Panther number six. The Panther at Bay, trapped with Mr. Little in the city of Samurai. Action in a mystic realm. 1977. This is uh, November. Drawn by Jack Kirby. Number six. This one sold for one hundred and forty dollars. Again, these are off white pages. 
And when I get done with the videos, I always put these in a bag and vacuum board. This is Black Panther number seven. Doom is the song of the drums. Cover price is 35 cents. This is number seven, January 1978. This is number seven. This one sold for one hundred and seventy dollars. Again, these are off-white pages. Number eight, thirty-five cent cover. Black Panther, Way of the Warrior. This issue, meet son's family. They must regain their fighting heritage or fall before an inhuman foe. Again, this is drawn by Jack Kirby. <clears throat> it's number eight, and this is March 1978. This one sold for $80. $80. Black Panther number 9, 35 cent cover. The Panther fights the uncanny to reach his doomed domain. The Black Musketeers featuring Last Hope for the Wakanda. Again, drawn by Jack Kirby. That's uh, 1978. This is May 1978, number 9. And this one sold for $80. Like my t-shirt, I got that at the last conference show I went to. Nowadays, a new books go for like $3.99, $5.99. I don't buy any new ones. Can't afford it, and they don't really go up in price. If you like the story, that's fine. Black Panther number 11. It's a 35 cent one. Sinester are the servants of Kyber the Cruel. Again, it's drawn by Jack Kirby. 1978. September 1978. Number 11. This one sold for $124. Now, I believe the last one I have, number 14, 35 cent cover, Black Panther side by side with the mighty Avengers. You must meet the uh, face, the power of Chlor. This one isn't drawn by Jack Kirby. It's drawn by Jerry Bingham. The last Jack Kirby one, I believe, is the number 11. Number 14, because it has the Avengers. This one sold for one hundred and forty dollars. Uh, again, this is um, let's see, number fourteen, March nineteen seventy nine. Okay, that's the Black, uh, Black Panther comic books I have now. Hope you enjoyed the video. Again, the conference show is March 25th at the Holiday Inn right off the highway in Norwich. Hope to see you guys there. This is JT's Comics and Cards. Give me some thumbs up. Leave some more comments. I got a lot more conference to show you. And please subscribe to our channel. We're doing good. Hit that notification bell. And next time, I'm going to be showing you... These right here, the Star Wars Marvel Special Edition. This is number one. 
I got Conan the Barbarian. I got Captain America, the Bicentennial, the Defenders. I got quite a few of those I'll be showing you. So until next time, stay safe. Thank you. Have a great day.